Here's a GoPro Hero 8 Black. I'm gonna show you how to change the screen rotation or screen orientation. Okay, maybe you wanna lock it, maybe you don't. So very, very simple. If you go ahead and slide down from the top to the bottom, this is your dashboard here. And if you look at this icon on the bottom right-hand side, if I tap on that, you can see it says orientation locked. If I uncheck it, it's gonna say orientation all. So with orientation all, now if I go ahead and just flip it over, it's gonna go ahead and rotate you can see it right there, okay? Now the thing is, now the thing with the orientation all, you can see it's right side up right now, but if I go ahead and turn it upside down, like this, okay, it's upside down. Now if I go ahead and record, it's gonna lock into this upside down position and record. So for example, let me just go ahead, leave it just like this, and we're gonna go ahead and record. And now you can see how this looks, and now it's upside down, okay? You can look on here. Okay, it's actually right side up would be like this, and this is still gonna be upside down, and this is still gonna be upside down. So remember, when you have an or orientation free, as soon as you record wherever angle it's on, the up position or down position, that's how it's going to record. Now, if I go ahead and just, uh, let me stop that really fast, and then we're gonna go back down to, we're gonna slide back down again. Now, most of you guys are gonna have it like this. Basically, you're just gonna have it just like this and lock it in place like this. And now it's locked right side up, so every time I go ahead and record, it's gonna stay in the right side up position. Okay, right side up, right side up. Doesn't matter if I turn it upside down, it's still gonna be in the correct orientation. Now, if you always wanted to keep it like upside down, what you can do, if I just stop here. So let me go ahead and slide down to go to the dashboard again. Now, again, if I go ahead and make the orientation free and then I turn it over, now it's basically, it's upside down. And now I go ahead and lock it. Now, every time I go ahead and start to record, it's always gonna be in the upside down position, as you can see right there. Now, 99% of you guys will probably always just keep it on this setting just like this. Just go ahead, go back into your dashboard here. Oops, gotta go this way. Go into your dashboard, and then what you wanna do is just go ahead and make the orientation free and then go right side up, just like this, and then lock it. Okay, now every time you record or whatnot, it's always gonna be in the uh, upright position. Okay, so there you go, pretty simple. It's always gonna be in the upright position. It's locked like that, okay, so pretty simple.